Hi friends, welcome to HRB Embedded. Today we learn about a dust particle sensor interfacing with the node MCU. So obtain the data in an IoT platform like thingspeak.com. A dust particle sensor, a model number is GP2Y101. So now we can interface with the node MCU and on an Arduino IDE. We can check the air quality in a room where the dust sensor is placed. I uh, made a circuit with the 150 ohm resistor. So here a capacitor of 220 microfarad and 16 volt or 25 volts. So we can see that the circuit diagram of this model with the node MC which I have written a program. This dust sensor operate on the principle of light scattering. A photo detector and LED emitter opposes each other at an angle within. So let us see how these two are arranged within this dust sensor. We can see here. Here we can see that this is an LED and here we have a photo detector and so this is the wall where the air can pass into it. The air containing a dust flows into this sensor chamber causes the light scattered towards the photo detector here and sensor output voltage value varies according to the intensity of light scattered within this chamber which in turn corresponds to the level of dust in chamber. The actual dust density in the air can be calculated took an average in a linear calculation. Okay, now we will see that the sensor terminals and connection how we are going to connect. The first wire red so which connects to a plus 5 volts but in case of a node MCU we are connected to a 3.3 volts and second one is an analog pin this analog output of a sensor which is goes to A0 of node MCU. The third one is a sensor ground which is connected to ground of the node MCU. This is the LED pin which goes power up to a LED in the sensor. So next the terminal is LED ground. So this LED ground and sensor ground both are connected together. The last wire that white wire which is connected to 3.3 volts through a 150 kilo ohm which power ups to a photo diode. Okay, now we will check the value of dust density. So we have to go for a program which is already written on the IDE. So now we will go for an Arduino IDE. So here the program is written to the node MCU using Arduino IDE and this library is used to connect our device to Wi-Fi. Uh, this API key is used to write the data into the server at thingspeak.com. A0 is the pin which is used to retrieve the data from the dust sensor. GPIO4 is used to power the LED and these are the predefined time for our dust sensor which is selected and this is the calculation part for the dust density in a air and we are power low and here power high to the LED so that the, the scattered light should be fall on the photo sensor. Here we selected 3.3 volts instead of 5 volts because we are power up the, our dust sensor is 3.3 volts. The sample is calculated for 100 times and we have taken an average of the dust sensitivity by making this formula. So now the data is sent to the thingspeak.com using this string field 1. Okay, now we will upload the program to a node MCU. Go to your tools, select node MCU here from the ESP8266, select the COM port which is already connected, upload the program here. Okay, now the program is uploaded and go to a monitor, serial monitor. and it is connected to the internet. Once it was connected, Wi-Fi is connected, then the dust density is streaming on the serial monitor of the Arduino IDE. We can see that for a very three seconds, it starts streaming the dust density around us.
So if any smoke or any dust particles is enter into the uh, dust sensor cavity, and we can see that the variation of dust sensor values so in the screen or monitor screen, and we can check here. So it changes from 53 to 368 micrograms per meter cube. Once we are removed, so suddenly the dust sensor sensitivity or the dust density in the air is going to reduce slowly. Okay, now we will check the same thing. We will be streaming on the uh, thingspeak.com IoT platform that we can see here. It goes up to 368 micrograms per meter cube and it is reduced to 53 and it is continuously varies. And it, here the data is retrieved at the IoT platform. <laughs> 